love lesbian talk, okay? I love it. It's just like, imagine like, ah, uh, ah, uh, um, but it happened. You know the vibes. It's Jay. Hand me the lighter, I'm about to get litter than a bitch. Big, big, period. Are you serious? These hoes are acting all delirious and I ain't. You know the vibes. It's Jay. What's going on, Jay Squad? Plum Squad, it's your girl Jay. You already know. Welcome back to Jay Vibes, where there's a whole lot of great vibes going on. Big period. Today's video is a reaction video, and I'm not sure if you know of this YouTuber, but this is Jade Fox. I'm not even sure how I came across this video today, but we're going to be reacting to her first time using the strap. I don't know. I hope it's using it. I hope she wasn't taking it because she looked dominant. I mean, you know, she take it, she take it, but if she was giving it. I want to know how she was giving it. Okay. Before we get into this video, please make sure you are subscribed to my channel. I have three of them things. Three. Make sure you subscribe to all three. Like this video, comment down below, share, share, share this video, you guys. And also, I wanted to say before we got into this video, um, a few videos back, I did a YouTube promo for Chunky Funk, My Life Story. And I just want to say thank you so much for subscribing to her channel. Thank you so much for supporting her. She actually did reach back out to me for another promo because she got so excited. You guys have to reach her first 150 subscribers. So please, you guys, click the link that's going to be pinned in my comment section. Also, it's going to be in my description. And please make sure you go send her some positive vibes. Let her know that J-Vibes sent you with a whole lot of great vibes going on. And if you did not catch that promo on my previous video, I'll just let you know really briefly what her channel is all about. She started this channel because she started her life living with a kidney condition and lung disease. She had kidney problems all her life, but just got the lung disease. Been about three years now, and that was posted back in 2015. So she probably been dealing with this specifically since like 2012. Um, but now she's blessed, period. And she wanted to share her life with you guys in the world. So she hoped that you can all like, share, and subscribe, and leave comments, period. So it's basically you guys just her sharing her life story with you guys. Um, just because you may have some type of health condition, you guys, that you that's like out of your control. Maybe you were born with it. Maybe it came on later on. That doesn't mean you have to stop living. That doesn't mean that you can't do what other people are doing. That don't mean that you can't be the next big YouTuber. That doesn't mean any of that. And there's so many people out here in this world that are just like you, that are just like me, that can relate with little things in your life, big things in your life, some things, if not all things. And you guys, it's just free to support one another. So please make sure you click the link that's going to be pinned in my comment section. Also, click the link that's in my description. Send her some love. Subscribe to her channel, you guys. It's free to do it. You never know. You never know when you're going to need help yourself, okay? Your door handle might came off and you can't get in the door. We're gonna let you in on the inside. Me. <laughs> Let's get into this video, guys. So again, this is my first time strapping. I regret this already. This is from Jay Fox. I can't believe I'm not subscribed, but I'm gonna wait to see how the story time go to see if I'm gonna subscribe a thumbs up and thumbs down the video because that's what y'all be doing anyway. Y'all be waiting to the end of the video. Sometimes y'all even watch the end of the video, but y'all be like, oh, let me see. Let me wait, let me see, let me wait, let me see. Because, because. I peeped. I saw it and I peeped it. Leg it and do it. Let's. I'm nervous. Let's get it. What's up? Welcome back to my channel. So What's I realized that I've never. First of all, girl. I like your ass. I mean, you didn't ask for it either, but I never told the story of well, my first time strapping. I was pretending like I was, uh, yeah, what was like that? a horse, but then. I don't know what that What? This isn't starting off great. No. It's like the first time I did it. So, uh, well, uh, I was having consistent sex. And so I said, you know what, maybe it's time to shake the tape. It ain't nothing like some consistent sex. Oh Jesus, I'm getting chills. This I love lesbian talk, okay? I love it. Yes, consistent sex. People get strapped. So which in every you know gay girl's life is truly it's like a quinceanera. You level them and you found new ways to penetrate. So um congrats. And I don't know why, but for me it didn't seem like something that would be difficult. It didn't seem like 
something, it just seemed like one of those things that you just kind of try once and then you're just kind of good at it, like uh, like tennis. I got mine online and I paid so much, oh, wow. so much money for it, this dick ain't free for real. Oh. And for some reason, <laughs> I don't know why. Um, I have never brought an actual strap and used a strap. Um, will I consider it? Hell fucking yeah. All right, but I ain't just about to be out here just strapping any in, in everybody. No, it's this one chick I ain't gonna lie. I want to strap her down tonight, but um, I don't even know if she like that. She might like that. Anywho, I just want to put that out there. I've never given it to anyone, but yes, I have received. I I bought the girth. Uh, nine inch dildo I could find. Great is nine inch. Hey Siri. Hi there. Can you do me a favor? Why, why I gotta keep pushing the button to talk to you? Can, can you do me a favor? Of course. Can you find the girthiest nine inch dildo? To, to hook into the harness. I don't know why I got one that big. I assume that that's what would be expected of me. And then also, I, I found conflict. I found myself conflicted because I didn't know if I should get one that was my skin tone or not. Like, do I get one that's like, you know, Raven Simone flavor? Okay, so listen, 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 Linda, listen. Yeah, you get the nine inch and. Yes, it needs some metal skin. Now, unless it do some crazy stuff like shake, vibrate, twist around, water leaks out, unless it does something really exotic and crazy, then it can be another color, like black or not purple. I don't know what I have against purple dildos. It's just so childish to me. I mean, I don't know. Show me, show me a purple dildo that that get the job done. Just a lot of purple dildos and toys are just childish like they don't vibrate hard enough they don't shake the room you know what i'm talking about but uh yeah get your color what you know what you gonna get what you gonna what you gonna get perfect do i get one that's like you know male shock me like myself like which one do i get either way i bought the shaquille o'neal dicks i distinctively remember it having a very big head on it it wasn't proportionate to the rest of the situation. It looked like T-Boss haircut. You know how like T-Boss like haircut like kind of like hang off the sides a little bit? There's a lot of excess on the sides. Like you need to cut the crust off because it's too much. So that was a poor decision. Um, yeah. Especially considering I was not thinking about my partner at all. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, what the fuck? Bitch, you would've scared me? I would've told you. I just came on my period. But what I can do is put a tampon in it and you know you can still use your tongue. But the whole penetration part, yeah, that's that's already fulfilled. It's already uh it's already stuffed. Bitch! Wasn't would have consulted them before I bought it. Oh and yeah. Consider your partner, duh. You that's a conversation that y'all supposed to have. You don't even know the bitch could take a nine in. Bitch probably could only take a pinky. I didn't do that at all because I was dumb. I didn't think that, hey, maybe there's just people that don't want to feel the dick, you know, in their nostril cavities. So on top of that, <laughs> the gayest thing about this whole thing is the only reason why I bought it, the only reason why this is something that happened in the first place. The first time I was having sex with at the time, their birthday was coming up. And so I decided we that I would be one of the gifts <laughs> that we got started. Boom, boom, boom. Things are oh my are goodness. Really and I said, you know what? <laughs> Tonight is special. <laughs> Take about 15 minutes putting that shit on. It was like trying to strap a baby in a car seat. <laughs> Proceeded to use it. And I never knew I had certain muscles in my thighs. Oh. Before that night, because I had never used them. There were so many muscles, so much <laughs> cardio involved, like way more than I anticipated, and I didn't even stretch, like not even, not, not a fucking thing. Ah, oh, screaming! At all, it was just 
way harder poor choice of words i was just bad at it the shit kept popping out oh popping off no matter let's see now that's that's that stuff that's just uh that's just an unnecessary disruption of the functional that's going on in in the red room i cannot stand let me tell you something get, get your dick together get your get your dick together want to keep and when she say pop out she mean like come out the the, the strap part okay I don't, that's just, oh my God, it's such an inconvenience. It's like, again, 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 like, do you not know how to use your, like, come. I don't like when all that other stuff be going on and stuff like that. Unnecessary. How much money I spent on it, the shit still is bound to pop off every now and then. And then it makes a little pop noise when it does it. It makes a little, like, noise when it does it. So it's just embarrassing, and it's just like, imagine, like, Yo, it's the uh, one purple polished thumb for me. Now, let me go ahead and subscribe. Definitely gonna like this video, y'all. I'm gonna definitely leave a comment. All right, so um, I definitely subscribed, gave her a thumbs up, and I left the comment, you guys. This was a pretty interesting story. Um, I don't think her first time strapping went too bad other than the... Bitch, I can't fucking do it because I ain't about to scratch up my, the inside of my mouth. Yeah, she could have gave some more detail. Like, she could have gave way more detail. Like, how old were you? You know what I'm saying? Would you live by yourself? Was you at her house? How old was she? Was she like a lesbian or was she bi, straight, whatever? You know, I'm nosy. I'm in her business. Yeah, don't do that. Anywho, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Please, 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 again, make sure you go subscribe to Chunky Funk My Life Story. Please make sure you go subscribe and support. Also, make sure you all subscribe to my channel. Like, comment, share, all that good stuff, you guys. I am signing out to the next video with the bat, the bat, the bat, the bat, the bat, the bat, the bat. Reaction videos and the next reaction videos actually gonna be on my J Files Reactions channel. So please make sure you are subscribed and I'll see you over there. Be blessed, stay clean. I love you. Mwah. Nah, I ain't conceited. I I'm a different breed. It. Catch you slipping, best belief. I don't need no reason. I'ma cut the ties, ho. Turn your wife to my ho. Just focus on you, baby girl. <laughs> J Vibes, you know the vibes, you know the fuck going on. And I'm out this bitch. Just take a bow like my name Rihanna. Now she buying seven rings like I'm Ariana. Where's a lot of great?